Well, we've been telling you about a cotton gin in our area that was completely shut down following Hurricane Harvey. In fact, the storm caused millions of dollars in damage at the gin. We're telling you about the Richardson Co-op Gin out in Woodsboro. And that's where Sunrise reporter Roland Rodriguez is this morning. And Roland, uh, looks like things are back up and running there. Uh, good morning, Mike, and good morning, South Texas. It's been a long and tough road for the Richardson Co-op Gym here, here in Woodsboro. And like you said, yeah, the good thing is now they are back in business. Two years ago, Hurricane Harvey ripped through the Richardson Co-op Gin, causing millions of dollars worth of damage and destroyed their cotton season. We took uh, pretty much a direct hit. We had uh, over $6 million loss in cotton and over $2.5 million worth of property damage. Uh, it, it, it was a long road to recovery. Harvey's winds and rain wiped out entire fields, causing hundreds of millions of dollars to the Coastal Bend staple cash crop. Each one of the uh, individual round bales has about four, about four bales in it, and uh, a set of four of them, which is how we gin it in sets of four, is about 16 bales. Uh, each bale of cotton this year is worth about $300. So uh, you're looking at about $4,800 a module. When cotton farmers have a down season, it doesn't just affect the producers, it affects everybody in the industry, the cotton gin, the support staff, and the module and bale haulers. They count on this as a large portion of their income for the year that we'll, they'll gather in, uh, in 10 to 12 weeks. And uh, this year, they're, they're gonna kind of catch up a little bit for what they lost in 17. South Texas farmers are resourceful and resilient, and they have bounced back with yields just as good or even better than 2017. This means cotton gins will be working nonstop over the next few weeks. Uh, this crop will far surpass what Harvey took from us. Uh, like I say, that was going to be a 47,000 bale crop. This one's a uh, going to be a 57,000 bale crop. We've got almost 34,000 of that gin with uh, about 23,000 to go. And uh, thank God the uh, hurricane season looks like it's about over, so I think we're going to get to keep this one. Let me also add with this year's bumper crop, the Richardson Co-op gin is expected to gin more than $17 million worth of cotton. Mike. That is a lot of cotton. Thank you, Roland.